Hello everyone, my name's Cold Faison, and welcome to my Let's Play of Donkey Kong Country 2, Diddy's Conquest. Oh my god, I'm so excited! <laughs> this is by far my favorite Donkey Kong Country game ever. Well, just Donkey Kong in general. Like, out of all of the games ever made for Donkey Kong, this is my favorite one. This is the best. This is where I will say that the sequel is way better than the original. I mean, the original's really good, but... Man, you gotta admit, DKC2, I think, just adds, just, it adds on top of the original. It's just such a good game. Let's go ahead and get started. Oh my god, I'm only one player, because I'm a loser by myself. I didn't know this, but on the Super Famicom version, it actually has the colors of the controller on here. Like, because, you know, this is the American one, so it's got, like, the American color and stuff. It's got the Super Famicom, Super Famicom colors of the Japanese one. Okay, I can't talk. Anyways, so for those of you who don't know, uh, Donkey Kong Country, at the very end, you beat King K. Rool on his ship, which is called right here the Gang Plank Galleon. And so this is where Donkey Kong Country 2 takes place, right after you beat King K. Rool. This is called Crocodile Isle. Love the name. Um, but yeah, we're gonna be on the ship. And here we go. Oh my god! <laughs> Alright, we're gonna be starting off with the very first level Pirate Panic. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Yee -yee. Come in here. And there'll be a little note that reads and says, I've kidnapped that lumbering fool Donkey Kong. You'll never see him again. Ha <laughs> ha ah! Captain K. Rule. So, uh, King K. Rule kidnapped Donkey Kong. So, apparently, the story is, like, after Donkey Kong beat King K. Rool in the first game, he's lounging around, relaxing. I don't, is that, like, at the beach? I don't know. Anyways, Cranky's like, man, you know, I would have never relaxed. I would have kept, you know, like, lifting barrels and all of that stuff. And, uh, he's like, ah, whatever, I beat King K. Rool. And then, he, like, he got kidnapped, basically. They, uh, they kidnapped him when he wasn't, uh, uh what's the word? What's the word? Um, he, he wasn't expecting him. So now it is up to Diddy to go ahead and rescue Donkey Kong. And he is here with Dixie, which I didn't know this until recently, but Dixie Kong is Diddy's girlfriend. <laughs> I like didn't know that. Uh, but yeah, so just like in the first game, I mean, there's secrets and stuff. There's also something called DK, a DK coin. Oh wait, what am I doing? I'm like I already got Dixie. And what you can do in this game is you guys can, like, get on top of one another to, uh, extend your reach. Extendo reacho, I guess so. This is very nice. Oh, okay! What?! <laughs> you gotta be kidding me, bitch! What?! I thought I was gonna get him! <sighs> oh, we just keep running. First, uh, bonus is right here. So usually there's about two bonuses in every level, sometimes one, sometimes there'll be three. Which in this first area here, um, oh wait, there's a banana coin here. There's so much to explain, but not really. Crem coin. <laughs> so every bonus level has a crem coin. And we need crem coins to access, uh, the secret area in the game that I'll be doing at the end of this Let's Play. It's called the Lost World. And there's five levels in there, and you need 15 creme coins to access each level, so that is about 75 coins. And we have Rambi, the rhinoceros. Ah, he's a cute little boy. I I miss Diddy, so this is a little awkward. Um, but right here there is an arrow, and um, you basically charge to the left. And yeah. And the bonus level tells you what you got to do. So in this case, you got to destroy him. The other ones, it's like, find the Grim Coin, or like, collect the stars. And, uh, yeah. Pretty easy. Some of them are a little bit more annoying than others. Or a little bit more, uh, difficult than others. Where is the DK barrel? There's the DK coin. There's one in every level to collect, so need that in order to 100%. Of course, you know, you got the classic Kong letters for an extra life there. Sorry if I'm, like, going a little bit fast with my wording, and just, like... It's it's a lot different when you're playing, and, it, like, you gotta explain stuff. So, unfortunately, I lost Diddy, but, I mean, I'll get him back, don't worry. And so, at the end here, you are given this little target with the barrel and stuff like that. And, um, depending on which Kong you have, they have a little fun solo at the end, so... I wanna go ahead and try to go for this extra life here, so... <gasps> oh! Oh, 
so good. So yeah, Dixie has a guitar solo at the end. Uh, Diddy has a a little like I guess boombox rapping kind of thing. I mean that one's cool too, but I much prefer uh, Dixie's little guitar solo she's got. And once you have gotten all the bonuses in the DK coin, you'll see uh, you know, the exclamation point at the end, which indicates you got all the bonuses, and then you got the DK coin, which means, you know, you got the DK coin. So on to the next level. This one was Pirate Panic. I think I said that before. This one is Main Brace Mayhem. This one takes place, I think, on the... the ship's post helm, I think? Yo, where is... Oh, oh my gosh. I thought I was going to get myself killed. Anyways. <gasps> I thought I was gonna die. The first bonus is right here. I think this one actually has three bonuses. Find the token! Uh. Don't worry, I will. These ones are pretty easy. Um, so you got the creme coins, and then you also have these banana coins, which is a currency for the Kong family, because, you know, they're scattered around the areas. They try to help you, give you hints and all that stuff. So yeah, oh yeah, and we got, we got Diddy! I don't want to lose him. I want to show off his little boombox. Solo. You know, I'm not gonna lie. I think I might have forgotten where some of the bonuses are. <laughs> okay! You know, that's totally fine. Wait, no. I think I know. I think this is the one with the cannon. Don't you dare die. You can kill those guys, which I never knew that. I thought you could never kill those guys unless you had a box or a barrel or something. Oh gosh, I'm scared. <sighs> Um, I love doing that with Diddy. I love his little cartwheel thing. Oh, excellent. Okay. I'm trying to remember. There's a balloon here. The green ones are for two extra lives. <laughs> I'm trying to freaking remember where the bonus barrel is. So like, if you jump, if you jump, you can uh, hit him there. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I actually didn't see that guy. I was not paying attention. <laughs> okay, wait, here's the second bonus area, the bonus thing. All right, let me get that. So I got a cannonball, and wherever there's a cannonball, there is a cannon, so you can go ahead and access the bonus level. Oh, I'm not going like too fast with my talking. I feel like every time I start up a new Let's Play, I always, uh, what do you call it? I, I do a lot of explaining, and I don't wanna really overwhelm people, I don't know. It's not too much, you know, you got banana coins for the, you know, Kong family, creme coins for the Lost World, and yeah. Obviously you got your bananas for a hundred, for an extra life. So that was the bonus number two there. And, oh, there's the last coin. And there is the final bonus! I think, it was, I forgot what Teta Capri Sun used to say, Boshi Barrel. I think that's what he used to say. Cause I would watch him play, um, hit like his old Let's Plays of Donkey Kong Country, and oh my god, they were hilarious. And as you can see, I didn't mention this, I am playing this on the Switch, because uh, a couple of months ago, they actually released Donkey Kong Country 2 and 3 on the Switch, and I was very excited. I was gonna buy this on the Wii U. I did not want to play the emulation version of this because um, I'll talk about this way later on, but there's a bug in the emulation, like if you try to emulate this game, where, um... Uh, there's something that gets bugged in a level, and it makes it extremely difficult, and I just, I don't know, I didn't really want to put up with that and deal with, like, some other, like, bugs that, that are potential in the emulation, so, yeah. Got the DK coin, I'll go ahead and show off Diddy's little solo here. And that was it. Um, uh, I mean, it's cool, but I just, I don't know. I love Dixie's guitar solo. Which one do you guys like? Do you like Dixie's ending or do you like Diddy's ending? Let me know. Um, but yeah, there's a emulation bug. I'll, I'll talk about this way later on, probably towards the end of the Let's Play. And um, yeah, up next we got Gangplank Galley. She really stopped talking because I want to get through all of uh, Gangplank Galleon in the first episode because it's very not very long at all. I just doing a lot of talking and stuff, so you know it, it ends up being kind of long. So this one we gotta find the creme coin in this block. Okay. Yeah. This is. Uh, I was thinking about that in my head. I was like, do I want to do this with Diddy? 
Though it's not that bad with him. So, uh, did he hold stuff in front of him while well, Dixie holds it up on her head? So it, like, if you're trying to hit enemies uh, that are above you, it's so much easier to use Dixie. Where Diddy, it's like, you can still hit him, but there's a chance you could probably get hit from above. Or it's Dixie, you know, she's holding stuff above so she could get hit from the side. Anyways, there's the hook here. DK coin right off the bat, right there. And, um, yeah, so you'll probably- <clears throat> So, when there's stuff above me, you'll see me use Dixie a lot. Or if it's something in front of me, I'll probably use, uh... See, like, this would be good for Diddy. If they're to- if they're to the side of you, Diddy's the character to use. Ooh, okay, I thought I was gonna get hit there. My nose is itchy. Wait a minute! Also, guys, um, I finally did it. I'm proud of myself. Uh, I'm gonna hit you with this. Oh my god, he went off screen. I hate it. I'll just wait. All right, there we go. Extra bonus there. Um, I actually ended, or uh, actually ended, added an end slate to my videos. It'll be the first Let's Play where I actually have an end slate. It's something super impressive, but I was really happy and proud of myself that I added one because uh, I've been meaning to add one for such a long while now. And uh. Yeah! Anyway, so, um, you got these regular, like, creme guys here, but then you got the buff ones here. So if you hit him once, he'll get, like, super angry, and then the second time you try to hit them, yeah, you'll end up losing your Kong, so it's- Ooh, I thought I was gonna get the hit here. Oh, I am actually kind of sad I lost, uh, Dixie there. <laughs> I was just trying to show an example, man! <sighs> okay, I think I could do this, though, so... Over here, there's a hook. Okay, you know, I wanted to... <sighs> I wanted to... What do you call it? I wanted to carwheel off! <sighs> Where's my barrel? Okay, there it is. That's what I get for trying to show off an example. Okay, so... <laughs> there's a little, um... Barrel here to the left. And you can get some extra goodies here. That's what I just wanted to show it. And this barrel here is an invincibility barrel? I need to be careful. Okay, the G. I'm actually surprised I got all of the con letters. Extra life. Uh, but the whole point of that is to kill the bigger buff guys. So you can go ahead and get this bonus barrel. <laughs> and... There's our crumb coin. Crumb coin spelled with two K's, by the way. K R E M K O I K O I N. No, wait! Oh my God! You know what? <laughs> God, playing on the switch. Don't worry. I'm not gonna always do that. I promise you. I'll do the full death, and then if it's something difficult, I'll probably end up cutting it to what I need to do. So, anyways, there's an extra life here. I want it. And the uh, Yeah! Hit that guitar solo! <laughs> Alright, we got everything in there. And this is Kong College, you know. If you're already sick of school enough, it's time for some college! Some monkeys, look at that! 9 divided by 3 equals 6! Oh my gosh, bitch, do you not know math? What is this? Holy shit! Oh, I'm not even reading what she's saying. I'm a man about to teach courses on how to play this game or you can just pop in when you want to save your little old game. Now then, how can I help you? I just moved up on the control and the control stick and it just exited out. Okay. Hope you're better behaving than those reptiles. Well, I even got one sharpening his sword in class yesterday. It's supposed to be like a pencil or something. Um, so in Con College, you can save your game. And uh, she's got some other hints too. Or she like, she just gives you some knowledge because you know, it's college. I think I actually passed Cranky Kong's thing too. Um, so, you know, Kong family coins, and she like talks about, go car with a bunch of bananas on and collect these and spend them on in the various Kong family locations found throughout the island. Why do I sound old and sound like a southern? Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and save. It's free. Um, but after this, she'll start charging you coins, which is why you want to collect uh, a good amount of these banana coins. I'll be here if you need me. Bye, stingy ass. Uh, but yeah, uh, there's Cranky Kong up here with the Monkey Museum. 
He's like, come say hello to your old grandpappy Cranky. I'm back by popular demand to offer you welcome. Wait, no, is that old? Is that the old man's house? Yep, gameplay wisdom. Wait, I didn't read the rest. Game can't wait. Game rules are gonna whoop your hides this time. Whipper snappers, I'd better take over before you embarrass yourself. Oh, please. Wait, is that two cranes that you have? Or canes? He's a fraction of mine. And, and, and viable dollars. Yeah, so him. He gives you some hints and stuff in Pirate Panic, or like just throughout the levels. Try using your deep throw at the start. Stuff like that. Then he'll start charging you because every Kong is um a greedy little whore. So, <laughs> what did he say? Wait, I want to go back to that. Did he, did he say his wife? Wait, what did he say? Should be real easy for you now. Oh, damn it! <laughs> I didn't see what he said. He said something about his wife. Um, anyways. Is his wife Wrinkly Kong? This is Wrinkly Kong, by the way, the old lady. If so, like, you know, I don't know too much about the family. Like, here I said in this episode that I found out that Dixie is, uh, Dixie's the girlfriend of Diddy. <laughs> is Wrinkly Kong his wife? Anyways, uh, we're gonna do Lockjaw's Locker. Did -de -de. Is this the water one? Oh god, it is! I'm gonna go to the right over here so we can go ahead and get a penny and a coin. So, water, um... Depends on how the water levels are, but, um... I'm not a super huge big fan. You know me, I, I love my lava levels and stuff. Um, but, uh... With this level, they like to... Yeah, there we go. I was gonna say, they like to put stuff you can go through, even though it's, it's a solid object. So, it's just some goodies right here. But, um... Yeah. Good thing, though, is in this level, there's only one bonus barrel. <gasps> and, don't you dare hit me. Go ahead <gasps> and get one of our animal buddies, Ungar. I love Ungar. <laughs> no, oh my god, why didn't you stop it? Please, is he gonna come back? Yeah, he is. Okay. <laughs> I thought I was gonna lose him. So, um, I don't absolutely love water levels. They're okay. I love it when there's sea monsters in them and stuff. It makes it scarier. But um, Unguard, in my opinion, makes water levels so much more fun. So, uh, DK Braille here, there's bananas, where you can go up here. And they give you the A symbol. And there's this banana here. And what they want you to do is use uh, the little animal powers, you know, their special ability. Well, I mean, is that really a special ability? Not really, I, don't, I mean, because they all have that charging thing. So basically they want you to charge into that box there because it's a whole new world apparently in that little box so we're gonna find the creme coin here which <sighs> and i don't really like this one uh sh I... oh god i gotta go down here it's all the way to the upper right i'm just trying to go all the way up so i'm like confuse myself there we go easy that's eight so far Huh. And all we need to do now is just, uh, get the DK coin and be done. Oh, gosh. God, you don't go off screen through the boxes. <laughs> but yeah, the DK coin isn't that bad. I mean, even if you don't have Unguard, you can still get it. Goodbye, Unguard. Do I have a, the K in the O? Oh, I missed the O. Ah, uh, well. I mean, it's not a big deal. Again, you don't really need the con letters to 100% it. It just gives you an extra life, which is nice. Do -do -do -do. Oh, God. Hey, Ungard. What up? Do -do 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 uh, the water levels will be a little bit more frustrating as we go on, but... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, I is it, I think it's this. I'm not sure. Got to charge it to the right. Yes, and that always how that is how we get our DK coin. Fish out of water. Hurry up! He's gonna die. <laughs> uh, wait. Who did I do? I think it was Dixie. I'll go ahead and do Diddy. I want to get this uh extra life here, man. <laughs> Be patient. <laughs> That's so good. 
All right. 100% done there. You know, I just realized I didn't do Swanky's bonus bonanza. I, you know, I'm blind. <laughs> Cause I was like, wait, there's Cranky and Wrinkly. I didn't know he was here. Swanky's bonus bonanza is basically, um, he's like a talk show guy. Get the big hand, folks. Good evening. I'm Swanky Kong and you're tonight's contestants on my bonanza. It's easy to play. Just pick a game and you're away. Swanky Swag. I just picked something. What is my name? Your name is Swanky. Well done! Let's have another. What is the first enemy that you see in the game? A furry rat? <laughs> what is the name of this area of the island? This is called Gang Plank Galleon. And we get ourselves a uh, extra life. So you can do these other ones. Oh my gosh, do I want to try? I guess I can. Pirate Puzzle. What button do you press to run? Dude, wait, because like, I'm on the Switch. Is it this? Is it the same layout as Super Nintendo? Dude, I don't even know. Why? Okay. What is the name of the first level in the game? Pirate, <laughs> Pirate Picnic. I almost hit that one. Pirate Panic, okay. What is the name of the enemy boss who has kidnapped Donkey Kong? It's King K. Rool. Captain K. Rool. Two? Oh my gosh. Wait, does that mean the third one gives me a blue one? Gym challenge. In the first level of the game, how many windows did the captain's cabin have? Oh my god! Do you think I know this? Oh shit. Shit! Okay, four. Okay. Do I, you want me to remember this? Oh my god. It's like Banjo Kazooie all over again with uh, the freaking. Oh my god, I don't even remember anymore. <laughs> Wait, I don't even know what it said! <laughs> I'm gonna go with the one. Okay, there we go. I was gonna say, because, like, that's familiar. Because I, I didn't read it. In the first level of the game, which of these is not a background object in the captain's cabin? Sword, map, a gun. Oh, shit. I mean, you're a pirate. You have to have a sword, right? A gun. Oh, my God! Oh! <gasps> Yeah, I'm leaving the studio. So, um, yeah, he basically asks you uh, questions um, in that area. And I was like, man, he's in the second area, but I didn't see him in the first. I'm I was totally blind, so that's basically what it is. Just answer questions, get extra lives and all of that. I was going to say, it's like the, um, oh my god. I cannot remember the name of it, Banjo-Kazooie. Uh, uh, I, I hate myself. Oh, never mind. Okay, I was about to cut, and I was like, wait, I remember. It's Grunty's Furnace Fun. That's what it's called. Anyways, we're going to be doing, doing Top Sale Trouble. Let's go ahead. Try to wrap this up real quick. I don't want this video to go super long. <laughs> we get another animal friend. This is a new one in the second game. His name is Rattly the Rail... Uh, Rattly the Rail... Rail... Rattly the Rattlesnake. Oh, my God. <laughs> Tongue twister. Holy shit. Well, at least for me, at least. Uh, I'm trying to remember where the bonuses are. I think both of them you need rattly. Oh, that's an extra life. Actually, the bonus barrel is over here. I'm not the biggest fan of playing the, uh, like in this first area where you are either on the ship or on the helm of the ship, or like the ship mass. I think it's a ship mass. I'm not really a fan of those levels. Like this one, for instance. I like the ones where you're just like on the boat itself. Easy, easy, easy peasy lemon squeezy! <laughs> oh, wait! So, the other animals go sideways real fast if you like hold the charge, but he just bounces up! It's pretty much like, um,. Wink Winky Kong? Oh, I was gonna say Winky Kong. Uh, Winky the Frog? <laughs> Yay, McCoy! Ba -da -da. I think this got some banana coins? Yeah, I need all my banana coins. I am okay, I am so dumb. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Die. 
Okay, so the bonus barrels up there where those uh, dragonflies are. Oh, baby. I'm gonna jump over here and over here. We. You don't really need the dragonflies. If you got Dixon, you could just do this. <laughs> Pretty easy. <laughs> I'm the token! They say token, but it's. I don't know. <sighs> okay! <sighs> I'm dumb. Can I can I not do that again? At least they take you right above the barrel, so it's not as bad. And today's Wednesday! How's everyone's Wednesday going? Wait, just be patient. Oh my goodness. <gasps> but yeah, today's Wednesday. What up? I was like, do I want to am I ready to just do the episode? <sighs> I pressed her little her little ponytail swirling shit and it didn't do anything. Are you serious, Mia? Wait. Because I'm trying to remember where the DK coin is. It's... No, actually, it's more it's down here. It's where that uh, right side was. Because I wasn't sure if it was to the right or to the left, right? Yeah. All right, there we go. Yes, yes, easy, easy. And the exit is just to our right over here. What do I have? Okay! Dude, I swear if I die. No, I wanted the G. That's okay. Banana coin's fine. <laughs> I'm so sad I hit that. <laughs> All right. And of course, we got funky flights. <gasps> Looking good, dude. I'm Funky the main monkey, and my new funkiest flights can take you anywhere on Crocodile Isle. Provided you've already checked it out, of course. This music's so good. Cruise on over to the barrel on the end, right side. So it's like, you know, in the first one, uh, Funky Kong takes you to the other areas in the game if you need to get there. Which I probably will because... Uh, actually, uh, yeah. Yes, no, yes. Yes, I will. Anyways, this is the boss here. Crow's Nest. So this is the boss of the first area! This damn bird. If I can get up here... I'm actually gonna switch to Diddy, just in case. You'd be my backup boy. Um, if you jump on the egg here... Ugh! I can't. <laughs> uh, above his nest there, there's two banana coins I'd like to get, but if I don't, it's not a big deal. And he takes four hits, so... Come on, dude! Never mind. Wait! I don't- I want to do Dixie's! <laughs> okay, never mind! <laughs> I'm so sad! If I get hit here? Oh my god. He's dead. I wanted to do Dixie's solo, but that's what I get for trying to switch and try to get banana coins. Anyways, that's gonna be it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed the first episode of uh, Donkey Kong Country 2. In the next episode, we're gonna be heading into Crocodile Cauldron. Oh, as you can see, to the left here in uh, Gangplank Galleon, we got the exclamation point and the DK coin, meaning that we got all the bonuses and all DK coins in this area. So yeah, oh my god, I'm gonna be ending my end slate. It's not gonna be amazing, but uh, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys later.